Keen to help Alad get over his drumming crisis, Eric's organized a masterclass with one of the most famous drummers in the world. Stuart Copeland from The Police created a unique drum sound by fusing rock with other very different styles of music. Stuart shows Alad the amazing skill he uses on the classic police song, Can't Stand Losing You. Stuart begins by checking out Alid's basic drumming technique by arranging a little jam with him. That's good, you got that. Okay. I should be practicing that a lot, shouldn't I? I told you that. Okay, yeah. let's work on a song that you're actually gonna be. What's the Led Zeppelin song? We're talking about it's... rock and roll. No, that me, that's gonna be hard. Your right hand is gonna get really tired. Yeah. And the main yeah. thing about that right in there, yeah, is to just relax. Mm -hmm. And relaxing is what it's all about. And also before the gig, do your do your exercises. Right. Eat your Wheaties and do your and because the more you relax, the less gas you have to burn. Stuart notices Alad's big flaw. Lonely, 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 lonely time. <laughs> cool. <laughs> We didn't go through the whole song. Yeah, but, uh, but, but the thing, the thing that I can see that you're you're burning so many calories because all up your shoulder is like, ah, yeah. just loosen up, and it'll be a lot easier. It's a full-on song, though, isn't it? It's a full-on song. The thing is that the whole song is a lot longer than that. Yeah. <laughs> you know, there's an expression which is to play outside your instrument. Mm -hmm. And what that means is that you're, you're not in here thinking, okay, I will now strike the snare drum, followed by an execution of the bass drum. You're not thinking. You're focusing on the rest of the band. And guess what? Your hands actually work better that way. Mm. If you're, it's like the old thing of the, you know, ask a centipede how he walks and he's going to trip, you know? <laughs> As soon as he starts thinking about it, oh my God, a hundred legs, you know. <laughs> and so it's the same thing. You get outside your instrument and everything will come more naturally. I that. mean, it's really interesting that you've actually been able to crack the basis of it. Thanks. Cool, man. Good luck. Really, really brilliant to meet you. Really All right, nice. cool. I hope Thanks. you have a good show. It's incredible. It's like every time I see Eric play, it's incredible, you know, and it's like because you, you aspire to be anything or like one eighth of as good as, as they are. But I just, I'm just happy that you know I didn't expect him to be so amenable and so kind of up for it and you know he doesn't give lessons to anyone he was saying to me no one at all he won't do master classes with anyone in the world he has to do one lesson a year in LA and he hates doing it and he's come here and he's like given so much of, his, of himself you know yeah. I definitely feel more kind of energetic about it now like, I feel like I want to attack the drums a lot more than, than just kind of, you know, sit behind them. I feel like I, yeah. you know, I really...